अर्जुन उवाच संस महाबाहो तत्वेच्छा वेदि त्याग से चुषी केश Arjuna asked this question the entire Gita is a question and answer session between Arjuna and Krishna and this is the last chapter of the Gita and Arjuna's last question to Krishna so he says o mahabaho mighty armed one o rushikesh lord of the senses i desire to know the truth of sanyasa renunciation and of tyaga abandonment separately o keshini shudana killer of keshi so arjuna has heard these terms sanyasa and tyaga forget arjuna we have heard these words many of us have given up our mother tongues many of us have given up so many things that are indian but these two words we have certainly heard isn't that true how many of us truly understand what they are and how many of us understand the distinction between the two so the question arjuna asked not with a challenging attitude arjuna asked this question with utmost respect and reverence you can feel it in the manner in which he asks and it's not just respect it's deep love how do we know this he uses three proper nouns mahabaho mighty armed one rishikesh lord of senses keshini shudana killer of keshi now when you use proper nouns to address a person it indicates love you know when a mother deals with a child how does the mother talk to the child the mother doesn't keep saying you he she come here my little sweetheart my kuchipu my this my that so many terms so many names she uses for just that one little child what does that indicate extreme love she has so much love for the child that one name is not enough so she gives the child 10 different names and addresses the child by different different name and that is what communicates love so also arjuna and krishna throughout the gita have used different names for each other because an atmosphere of affection of oneness of love facilitates the transfer of knowledge let's face it this knowledge is a difficult one you can't put it in a test tube and see it you can't analyze it and get it you can't even get it if the teacher has it it requires a struggle the struggle is because we are trying to break free from the limitations the imprisonment the tangibles and move into the untangible intangible sorry so because it's difficult all the more it's necessary that knowledge should be transacted in an atmosphere of confidence of love of complete trust now when i say this it doesn't mean blind belief please it doesn't mean blind uh, following it means that in an atmosphere of affection it is easier to understand that's all that it is verse 